So it's been a busy day here at the home place, of course. Um, we've got lots of volunteers here today. They're all eating over here. Um, about 21 or tw somewhere between 20 and 25 people. Um, we had the Marjorie Oakley women's group from Logan and uh, we have the um, Goodwill Industries of Kanawha Valley here today. And they've each had uh, 10 plus people here volunteering today. So um, the bridge, it needed a little bit of a facelift on the rails. Um, so this of course is the famous bridge Devil Ants built um, in 1891 when they were building the property here. Um, supposedly at one point it was a drawbridge before it was later cemented in after the feud but um we um got all the old paint off the railing and put new paint on but currently as you can see there's a lot of work that needs to be done to the poor thing but um we're trying to preserve everything one day at a time i guess um so they got that done today which is awesome and of course the two light poles on the end which were gas lanterns back in the day uh, when devil ants had it i've got uh, solar lights up there right now which don't even work really because of the street lamp up there but um yeah so they've been doing a lot of hardcore work today they also were able to pick up gravels um we had some large gravels as a base that we laid and then smaller gravel on top so when we get some kids and elderly people, you know, it's an easy fall risk. So they um, cleaned all that up today. They also stained the deck of the new museum building and the little moonshine steel shed beside it. So got that all sealed as well as um, a little stoop on the back that we also uh, sealed today. Um, they also were able to sand and stain Dad's handiwork here of the spool table he built with a seven-foot round spool. He chopped up and made a uh, a um, table, picnic table out of it for all the visitors to enjoy. So I think he'll be happy with that. Um, some other updates, though. We have the swing that was um updated with a new sign on top unfortunately the first one they made cracked so he had to make us a second one so it's a lot thicker a lot nicer too actually so it looks really great and of course we redid the well and got the uh, signage on that and um the brick facade around it um it's in a very busy spot as you can tell so I wanted to make it more primitive looking of how they would have had it looked back at the time. But it was kind of hard to do that with it being right in the area of all the vehicles driving. I needed to make sure it was sturdy. So I was kind of forced to make it with modern block instead of like river rock. Um, and of course being able to glue it down together. And as you can see the metal rim to give it a little more stability as well. But it is really cool. Um, everybody loves coming in here and pulling up water. So it's really neat. So, But um, got a lot done today. Um, and I'm very grateful for all the help that um, the community's giving and showing. So you guys are going to have to come and check out all their hard work that they've done today. All these people that you see, right? These are all volunteers, but United Way and uh, a local uh, women's uh, shelter, uh, something, something to that effect. And they've got um, a whole bunch of volunteers out here today, and they are just staining and scraping the old bridge. That's Devil Lentz Hatfield's old bridge right there. Had a rock fall Jack was showing us about a week or so ago. That's looking good, isn't it? It's a sluice for little kids. 
when they come over here, they can gem mine. And Jack getting everybody situated. But I'll go find. So you guys are United Way then, right? We are funded through United Way. We have grants through them. Uh huh. And uh, we are the recovery group of Southern West Virginia. Okay. So we house men and women in long term reco long term recovery in Logan. Mm -hmm. We have 16 beds for the men's house and 16 for the women's. Okay. And y'all just do volunteer stuff yeah. from time to time? Yeah. That's All really cool. <laughs> All the time. <laughs> <laughs> they help me. I, I'm the community engagement specialist, and I do uh, the fundraiser events. Mm -hmm. So they help me a lot with those whenever we need help because it yeah. takes more than one person to get it all done. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and then, uh, on. <laughs> now it's peace. You don't have to stop. You don't have to do it. So what, what you guys doing? Who who are you? What you do? What what are we doing today? <laughs> so we are with Goodwill Industries of Canoe <coughs> Valley, and we are participating participating in day appearing with United Way. Uh -huh. So right now we are putting a clear coat on this beautiful porch. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so where are you guys all from? Where are y'all from? So um, our Goodwill is based out of Charleston, but we actually have a 20 county area, and Logan County is one of the areas we serve, helping people with employment opportunities and putting people to work. Okay. So we were super excited to come down to Logan County because this is an area we might not get to. Our team might not get to visit as often. Our mission team is here, though. Yeah. 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 That's really yeah. cool, though. Yeah. That's really cool. And y'all, y'all can come do my porch when you get done. Okay. <laughs> okay. But, but no reviews left on Yelp or anything like that. Okay. <laughs> now we're super excited, and this is such a cool historic place. I think it everybody is. in West it Virginia is. knows about the Hatfield McCoys. So yeah. We, yeah. I was kind of excited for this one. So. Yeah. 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 It's a cool one. Yeah. It's a cool one. And Jack, yes, you've sir. you've done well here, brother. Thanks, buddy. You've done well. You've you started off. You if you remember. You started off with that house when that thing was, yeah, you know. Yeah, it was bad. <laughs> the house was even bad. There was contractors here for a month just getting the house yeah. livable again. Yeah. And look yeah. at her. Look at her now. Yeah. yeah, but you know what's crazy too is is I actually did a a, a historical presentation um, for um, who was there for again? Oh, generation West Virginia. But but where was we at? We were in Williamson. Williamson, yeah, yeah. in we Williamson. Were both there in the heart of yeah, I was trying. I was trying to trying to think of where we was at. It's Williamson. Yeah, Williamson, and there were Generation West Virginia, which is an awesome group of uh, future leaders that are um, learning and growing. You know, they'll be future leaders of our state. So, um, and I met some of these guys yeah, during there. during yeah. that event. Later. Yeah, this one's from Texas. Yeah. He said he's from Texas. Yeah. You got lost really bad. <laughs> All the way 